Tragedy has once again visited the Kennedy family compound in Hyannis. Saoirse Kennedy Hill, the granddaughter of the late Senator Robert F. Kennedy, died there yesterday at the age of 22. The family has not said how she died, but did release a statement that said their hearts were shattered by her loss. Saoirse was the daughter of Robert and Ethel's fifth child, Courtney. She was expected to graduate from Boston College this year. Eyewitness News reporter Kim Kalunian is in Hyannisport, where reaction continues to pour in tonight. Well, we're here in Hyannisport, just a short distance away from the Kennedy compound, where an American flag has been flying at half staff today. We spoke with several locals this afternoon who tell me their hearts are breaking for the Kennedy family as they face yet another tragedy. Quiet on Marchant Avenue in Hyannis after the death of 22 year old Sersha Kennedy Hill at her family's compound Thursday afternoon. It's tragic and really sad. Those we spoke with Friday remarking on this latest tragedy to strike the prominent Massachusetts family. 22 years old is just another tragic death for the Kennedys. It seems like they've had their share. Isn't that sad how everything? One after the other. Yeah. Sersha was the granddaughter of Robert F. Kennedy, who was assassinated in 1968. In a family statement, Sersha's grandmother, RFK's 91 year old widow, Ethel, said the world is a little less beautiful today. Former Rhode Island Congressman Patrick Kennedy took to Twitter to comment on the death of his cousin's daughter, saying, quote, Sersha will always remain in our hearts. She is loved and will be deeply missed. And the family's statement did not specify the cause of death for the 22 year old. The investigation is ongoing. In Hyannisport, I'm Kim Kalunian, Eyewitness News.